Hey there guys and welcome back to Lost Planet Extreme Condition. In the last part we were trotting through the volcano in our happy little walker machine. And I finally found the access way to the Frontier Project Dome thingamajiggy and crap there's another walker there. And I'm kinda handicapped here because, whoa, I don't know what kind of weapon that thing has but it's sure as hell damaging. And my homing laser keeps hitting the ceiling of the tunnel when I get too close so... I really need to get rid of that weapon f fast, although it is pretty nice, I must admit. Oh well, get him. Yeah, that looks busted. Get the thermal energy, thank you very much. Although I might need a replacement VS pretty soon, because this one isn't going to hold up much longer. Alright, free beacon. I'm not going to just walk past this one. Oh, crap. No, 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 no. At least let me charge the thing up. Yes, thank you. Okay, now we can shoot me. Preferably not, but if you have to, die. Just pump him full of lead and... Oh, huh, okay. That took care of him. And I think you would take jumping damage in this game, so I'm just going to jump down in this thing and see what happens. I mean, if it breaks, I don't care. Uh, okay, we're still good. Alright, I see some sparks coming from it, but that shouldn't be a problem. EM laser, what's that do? Do I really want to use it? Because it's probably another one of those use up your thermal energy weapons. Uh -huh. Okay, that's kind of a big version of what those sentry drones are packing. Hmm, doesn't seem that bad. Maybe I can make use of it. Alright. Why am I leaving my walker behind? Rocket launcher. Direct hit. I'm such an awful... Did I say awful? I'm an awesome sniper. Jeez. Talking about a Freudian slip. Alright. Take this. Let's see what that does. Oh, I missed. Great. No, oh, it's only... No, these are the same models that I'm using. Oh, crap. Yeah, that might be a bit of a problem. Come on, just one dead-on hit. That seems to have done quite a bit of damage. Okay, the EM laser is complete overkill, apparently. So I might want to stick to that thing. Although I could use a new VS, which... They are so nice to present, and... Oh, it's one of these... The humanoid looking ones with the arms. And they are really fast, which is nice because the previous one was kinda slow. I'm gonna get a Gatling gun and a rocket launcher, I can work with that. Alright, Turbo Dash! Uh, I don't really like the look of this place, it looks like a boss battle could start at any moment. Whoa! Careful, you can have my rockets though, I don't want yours. Can't really see him through all the smoke, but he's down already. Oh crap, another one. Maybe we're in some kind of production facility for these things. That'd be the only explanation I can think of. Come on. He has the high ground, I can't really hit him that well. I think that just hit the ledge. Yeah, that definitely only hit the ledge. Crap, I'm not gonna get him from here. Maybe if I fly. Although this thing can't really fly that long. You know what, first of all, we're just gonna... Tinker with this thing and see what it does. Get me some thermal energy, get a little sense of direction. Even though I probably don't need it, because we're in a base. And bases tend to have some kind of pattern to them. Unlike mountains and stuff. Ooh, more weaponry. What do we have? EM laser. Mm, I'll pass. Rocket launcher. Thank you. Eight rockets, that'll do. Alright, let's get up there. Oh crap. Up there, thank you. More rocket launcher ammo, jeez. Crap. No, oh, I didn't want that. Okay, my Gatling gun and rocket launcher have now switched places. Completely unintentionally, but whatever. Alright, now I can get him. Oh crap. Why do they always have double rocket launchers? Oh well, he's a big 
column of smoke now, so problem solved. Alright, now we just need to get up there. I think this would actually be pretty hard without a VS, because Wayne's grappling hook can only do so much. Okay, it appears to be a key Nevik military facility. I can see a bunch of those drilling spider walkers down there. That's pretty bad. I don't want to just take him out now. Oh crap, that one went in a tank form. But it can't really aim that high in tank form, so... That's a pretty stupid mistake. And bam! Okay, those things apparently only take one single rocket to kill. That's nice. And that one was a complete misfire. Oh, well, I can probably get him again if I just reload. Here! Okay, count that one out. And let's jump down there, see what happens. Uh, I knew it. Health bar. And you may have noticed the slightly awkward cut there. Yes, this is my third attempt at this boss. Cut out the previous two because... It's just a waste of time. Will you stop dragging my robot around? Anyway, here's the boss, a big version of the drilling spider walker. And this boss is pretty hard, otherwise I wouldn't have lost to it twice. And there's a little replacement VS just in case you need it. You might want to get up here so it can't hit you with the drills. At least I don't think it can. Grab it. Thing. Okay, that should be the last of those. And then just unleash all hell upon him. He's got really thick armor though. You won't really feel much of what you're throwing at him. In fact, my Gatling gun doesn't even seem to be doing any damage and rocket launchers only... Oh crap. Rockets only do like nothing. <sighs> okay, how about we try this one? Although I can always pick up that puddle my old VS left behind. Alright. New VS. Crap, no, I didn't mean to take that off. Ah, no! Oh, this is bad. Okay, I'll just pick it up when I'm in the VS. Alright, pick up the Gatling gun. Oh, sweet, this one has the EM laser. Think that might help me out. And here's the spider form. Which is a bit more vulnerable. At least it, it's not completely covered in really thick armor. And what's with all the sparks around it? Is that because of my EM laser? Is it some kind of shield or something? Oh, crap. Uh, I think this robot can dodge, but I really don't know how to pull it off. Oh, crap. Okay, that's how you pull it off. Just initiate the skating mode and get out of the way. Ooh, a grenade launcher. I guess I can make use of that. Whoa. Dude, talking about poor aim, I'm not even that far away from him, and he manages to completely miss me. This grenade launcher thing's pretty nice, causing some real damage to him. I don't ever recall picking that thing up before. Hmm, I guess that's the rarest of the VS weapons. Although, before this level, I hadn't seen the homing laser or the EM laser either. So, yeah. No. Crap. Please don't die on me now. Uh, did he just... No. And, of course, he can fly and crush me. Crap. Wait, is that another VS up there? Please. Yes, it is. I am saved. I hope that one isn't damaged from the ongoing battle. Nope. Good as new. Two Gatling guns, which don't do anything against him. Oh, great. I have to go look for some other weapons. Well, here we have a another Gatling gun. Come on. Throw me a bone here. Useful weapon, please. Rocket launcher, there we go. Alright, where is he? Take. Oh, crap. Okay, apparently I can no longer shoot the rockets out of midair. For some reason, if I even could before. I think I could. Alright, he's almost down. Just a few more rockets. Reload faster, come on, PLZ. Come on. It's either he dies or I die. And because I pretty much cut out all the failed attempts, you can tell what's going to happen. There we go, dead. Alright, that's the end of this mission. So, yeah. 
short episode, but that's because I cut like five minutes of attempts. 45 minutes for this mission again? Jeez, they're pretty long actually. So yeah, Lost Planet will be back next Monday, tomorrow, God of War. Thanks for watching and bye bye.